I'm Zoe Triska, the book's editor at the Huffington Post. I'm here with George Pelicanos, author of the new book, The Double. Hi, how are you doing today? I'm great, thank you. Can you tell us a little bit about this series? Uh, well, the first book in the series was The Cut, and it's about a guy who comes back from Iraq, Spiro Lucas, and he uh, takes a job as an uh, investigator for an attorney in D.C., um, criminal defense attorney. And he also does stuff on the side where he recovers lost property or stolen property, and he takes a 40% fee, which hence the cut, okay? And uh, the idea behind this character is that when I was talking to vets, I found that a lot of them, first of all, a lot of them did this kind of work, but also why they did it was because they were trying to replicate the um, sort of this experience that they had overseas where, you know, they got, had a mission every day. They got, they got up in the morning, they had something to do, rather than an office job or being in school, and um, so it fit the characters. And it, it allowed me to talk about what's going on with returning veterans. And so that's what inspired you, what the, the war, I mean, what inspired you to write the series? Yeah, I had, I had uh, written an earlier novel called The Turnaround where I'd done some research over at Walter Reed Army Medical Hospital and I got to know a lot of these guys who were recovering. And it just, uh, there was stuff I couldn't use for that and I wanted to expound on it, so. Um, and then the other thing was I wrote a short story about this guy's parents who adopted a bunch of kids this Greek-American couple that adopted this, uh, all these kids that were different you know, races and came from different places. And I wanted to write about that also because I have a family like that. I've, all my kids are adopted and, um, and the experience of that. So I put it all into this character in this book. That sounds really awesome and really amazing. I'm looking forward to reading the new book. Thank you. And where do you like to read? In my house, I have a red chair. It's by the fireplace. And so I light a fire usually and I'll sit there and read, maybe pour you know a couple inches of bourbon and put some music on. It's like a perfect room. What's the last book you read there? The last book I read there, I'm reading uh, James Lee Burke's upcoming novel, um, The Light of Day. The Light of the World, I think it's called. Okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's okay. And you you named up his name, I'm sure. That the... J James Lee Burke, it's a great book. Everything he writes is great, so I'm really enjoying that. And what's the one book or author that you'd recommend everybody read? True Grit. True Grit by Charles Portis is my favorite novel. Did, how do you feel about the adaptation? Did you see it? I've seen them both. I saw the John oh, Wayne original yeah. and, the, uh, and the Coen Brothers remake, and I like both films for different reasons. That's great. Thank you so much for your time. My I really pleasure. appreciate yeah. it. It was Thank good meeting you. you.